So students often complain to me about workshop. They don't like to do workshop. And I can sort of understand where they're coming from. First, it's really hard. When you have to read somebody else's work and give them feedback and think about their writing and think about what their writing could be, it's, it's a lot of work. It takes a lot of uh, mental energy. Um, the other thing is that students don't want to come across as you know, mean or critical of each other's work. And then last but not least, students are really concerned with, you know, they're, they're worried that they're not good writers themselves and so they're not going to give good feedback. And I want you to rest assured that if you're thinking any of those things, um, you still have to do workshop. And it is going to be challenging, but I want it to be a challenging assignment. But here's the thing. First, uh, it's great practice. You have to practice your critical reading skills. You have to practice your critical writing skills. You're thinking about your audience. You're thinking about tone. You're thinking about potential. And that's really good writing practice. You're not going to get that from just uh, writing essays. So mirrors the kind of writing that you're going to have to do um, in future academics and then in your careers. The other thing is that um, nobody's ever too mean. Like I've never had a student just be a total jerk. So if you're thinking about being a jerk, don't. You, you won't come across as mean and your classmates will really appreciate your honest critical feedback. Probably the meanest thing you can do is to just say, hey, I couldn't think of anything so I'm not going to write anything. And then finally, a lot of students are concerned because they think, well, I'm just a student, I'm just learning how to write, and so I don't know what to say. And I want to tell you that that's absolutely not true. First of all, you're all consumers of pop culture, you're all consumers of DMAC, and then you're all doing this assignment. So I'm not asking you to read it as a writing teacher, I'm not asking you to read it as an editor. I'm asking you to read it as a peer. So give them some feedback, tell them what you think, tell them how you're reading it. That's the most valuable thing we can give to our fellow readers is just how is it coming across? Are you getting it? What kind of questions do you have? They're not going to get that from just reviewing it themselves. They really need your thoughtful attention. So um, we're going to be doing workshops throughout the semester. Um, I know that it's a challenging assignment. I really do. But um, it's very, very good for you and it's very good for your classmates. And um, yeah, so good luck with it. Let me know if you have questions um, and let's workshop away.